In a world bustling with noise and distraction, there lies an ancient path whispering the secrets of inner peace and mental mastery, a path that has been trodden by seekers of wisdom for thousands of years. Guided by the teachings of one enlightened soul whose insights into the human mind and heart still resonate deeply today, as Buddha once said, we are what we think. All that we are arises with our thoughts. With our thoughts, we make the world. In this instant, as you join us on this journey, you are taking the first step towards mastering the art of mindful thinking, towards understanding the profound teachings that can transform your mind, your life, and your world. Lesson 1. Observe your thoughts. Don't believe them. Buddha's profound teachings remind us that the mind is everything. What you think, you become. This wisdom underscores the tremendous influence our thoughts wield over our lives. It's a reminder that our thoughts are not mere fleeting occurrences, but potent architects of our reality. Our thoughts shape our experiences and perceptions, yet not every thought reflects the truth. To truly master our minds, we must learn to observe our thoughts without unwavering belief in their validity. Imagine your thoughts as leaves gently drifting along a calm river. Each thought appears, lingers for a moment, and then gracefully continues its journey downstream. The key to mastering your mind lies in non-attachment. Just as you wouldn't desperately clutch at each passing leaf, refrain from attaching yourself to every passing thought. Avoid categorizing them as right or wrong, good or bad. Instead, develop the art of observing them with detachment. Picture yourself seated by the tranquil riverbank, attentively watching the leaves, your thoughts, as they float by. Acknowledge their presence without judgment, allowing them to come and go freely. This practice of detached observation creates a space between your thoughts and your sense of self. Within this space, wisdom blossoms, empowering you to respond to life's challenges with clarity and intention, rather than reacting impulsively based on momentary emotions or unexamined beliefs. You begin to understand that your thoughts are transient, passing through your consciousness like clouds in the sky, and they do not define your true essence. By adopting this practice of mindful detachment, you gain the ability to choose which thoughts to engage with and which to let go. This choice is the cornerstone of inner peace and emotional resilience. It leads to a profound realization. Your thoughts are tools that you can use to shape your reality consciously. By observing your thoughts without unconditionally accepting them as facts, you embark on a transformative journey. You develop a deeper understanding of the nature of your mind and its patterns. This understanding fosters self-compassion and a gentler approach to yourself and the world. Through mindful detachment, you unlock the potential to shape your reality in positive and empowering ways, guided by wisdom and grounded in inner serenity. Lesson 2. Perceiving the world. Our perception of the world is like a pair of glasses through which we view reality. These glasses are not fixed. They are tinted by our thoughts, beliefs, and past experiences. Imagine wearing glasses that make everything appear yellow. You would perceive the world as yellow, even though it isn't. Similarly, our thoughts and beliefs can color how we see the world around us. We have the power to change the tint of our perception. Just as you can switch to clear glasses to see the world as it truly is, you can challenge and expand your mental filters to perceive the world in a more open and compassionate way. This means recognizing that the world is not as black and white as we often assume. Consider the quote from Buddha. In the sky, there is no distinction of east and west. People create distinctions out of their own minds and then believe them to be true. What this means is that many of the divisions and boundaries we see in the world, whether they are cultural, religious, or political, are creations of our own minds. We impose these distinctions onto the world and then live as if they are absolute truths. Challenging your perceptions involves questioning these mental boundaries. It's about being open to the idea that there are multiple valid perspectives and that the world is far more interconnected than we often realize. When you adopt this broader view, it fosters understanding and connection with others. You start to see the common humanity that unites us all, transcending the limitations of our own mental constructs. 
Lesson 2 invites you to become aware of the lenses through which you perceive the world and to consciously choose a lens that promotes understanding, empathy, and unity. It's a powerful tool for personal growth and for building bridges with people from different backgrounds and beliefs. Lesson 3. Mind Control and Inner Serenity As Buddha once said, Peace comes from within. Do not seek it without. In our fast-paced world, finding peace and tranquility can often seem like an elusive goal. The wisdom of Buddha reminds us that the path to inner peace begins within ourselves. It's a journey that involves mastering our own minds, and it's not about suppressing our thoughts or running away from the external chaos. Instead, it's about creating a sanctuary of serenity within our own consciousness. Imagine your mind as a garden. In this garden, thoughts are like flowers blooming and withering continuously. Trying to suppress thoughts is like trying to pull out all the flowers, which can be exhausting and futile. Instead, what we should aim for is tending to this garden with care, nurturing the positive thoughts and allowing the negative ones to naturally fade away. The techniques of meditation and mindfulness are like the tools and practices for gardening your mind. Through meditation, you learn to sit quietly and observe your thoughts without judgment. It's about being fully present in the moment, just like tending to each flower in your mental garden. With mindfulness, this practice gradually creates a sense of calm, allowing your mind to settle, much like the stillness that descends upon a well-tended garden. Mindfulness extends beyond meditation. It's a way of living. It's about being aware of your thoughts and emotions as they arise throughout the day. This awareness helps you navigate your inner landscape with greater clarity. It allows you to choose your responses consciously, just as a skilled gardener selects which flowers to nurture and which weeds to remove. As you continue to cultivate this inner sanctuary, you'll find that peace truly does come from within. It's not something you have to seek outside of yourself. Instead, it's a radiant calmness that blossoms from the harmonious garden of your own mind. This state of inner serenity is a precious gift you can offer yourself through the practice of mindful awareness and meditation, allowing you to face life's challenges with equanimity and grace. Lesson 4. Engage in selfless acts. As Buddha once wisely said, happiness never decreases by being shared. This profound teaching reminds us that when we share happiness with others, it doesn't diminish our joy. In fact, it multiplies it. Now let's delve deeper into the idea of selflessness and why it is a powerful pathway to inner peace. Selflessness essentially means doing things for others without any expectation of personal gain or recognition. It's a mindset that shifts our focus away from ourselves and onto the well-being of others. Imagine this. You perform an act of kindness for someone, whether it's helping a friend in need, volunteering for a charitable cause, or simply being there for someone who's going through a tough time. You do it not because you want something in return, but purely out of the goodness of your heart. In these moments, something magical happens within you. Your sense of self-importance begins to fade, and you start to connect with a greater sense of purpose. The act of giving without expecting reciprocation frees you from the constraints of ego and selfish desires. As you engage in selfless acts, you become more attuned to the needs and emotions of others. You develop empathy and compassion, which are essential qualities for nurturing inner peace. It's like a ripple effect. The more you give, the more your heart opens, and the more peaceful and content you become. Selflessness has the remarkable ability to enrich not only your own life, but also the lives of those around you. Your acts of kindness create a positive impact, inspiring others to do the same. It creates a harmonious cycle of goodwill that radiates positivity into the world. So when Buddha encourages us to share happiness and engage in selfless acts, he's inviting us to embrace a life filled with genuine connections, empathy, and inner tranquility. It's a reminder that true happiness is found not in what we hoard for ourselves, but in what we generously share with others. By choosing selflessness, we embark on a journey towards a more peaceful and fulfilling existence, where our hearts are light and our spirits are bound. Lesson 5. Rationality and Control In Lesson 5, 
we delve into the profound concept of rationality and self-control. Imagine your mind as a ship sailing through the often tumultuous seas of emotions. Applying rationality is like steering that ship with a steady hand to avoid being tossed about by impulsive reactions. It's about finding the delicate balance between the surging waves of emotions and the guiding star of logical reasoning. This harmonious coexistence between heart and mind cultivates a disciplined and tranquil state of being. Let's explore this further. Imagine a situation where you're faced with a challenging decision. Emotions may surge within you, urging you to react impulsively, driven by anger, fear, or desire. But here's where the power of rationality and control comes into play. It's the ability to pause, take a step back, and assess the situation objectively. As Buddha once wisely said, to conquer oneself is a greater task than conquering others. This profound statement reminds us that our inner battles, the mastery of our impulses and emotions, are some of the most significant challenges we'll encounter in life. It highlights the importance of self-control as a path to true strength. By harnessing the power of rationality, we can make wiser decisions free from the chaotic influence of unchecked emotions. It's not about suppressing feelings but rather understanding them, acknowledging their presence, and choosing how to respond thoughtfully. Picture this as the skill of a skilled captain, navigating a ship through stormy waters, making deliberate and well-calculated maneuvers to reach a safe harbor. It's a journey towards inner harmony and a disciplined, peaceful mind. Remember, mastering rationality and self-control is a journey, and like any skill, it requires practice and patience. It's the art of steering your ship towards the shores of wisdom and serenity, one thoughtful decision at a time. Lesson 6. Emotional Agility Buddha's wisdom, encapsulated in his words, Just as a snake sheds its skin, we must shed our past over and over again, invites us to delve into the concept of emotional agility, a profound skill that is essential for our well-being. Emotional agility is like having a finely tuned compass for the ever-changing landscape of our feelings. It means being aware of our emotions and accepting them without judgment. Imagine emotions as weather patterns, sometimes sunny, other times stormy. Emotional agility empowers us to skillfully navigate through these emotional storms and bask in the sunshine when it arrives. Think of it as a dance with your emotions, gracefully moving through various rhythms. It involves acknowledging the ups and downs, the joys and sorrows, and understanding that they are all part of the human experience. One of the key aspects of emotional agility is resilience. It's about bouncing back from setbacks, disappointments, and adversities with grace and strength. Instead of being overwhelmed by difficult emotions, we learn to embrace them as opportunities for growth. Emotional agility means taking charge of how we respond to life's challenges rather than reacting impulsively. We pause, reflect, and consciously choose our responses. This deliberate approach to our emotions empowers us to make decisions aligned with our values and long-term well-being. Emotional agility is a journey towards inner harmony and balance. It enables us to shed the weight of past burdens and embrace the ever-changing nature of our emotional landscape. By practicing emotional agility, we gain the wisdom to gracefully adapt to life's twists and turns, finding strength and serenity within ourselves. Lesson 7. Live Simply As Buddha once said, contentment is the greatest wealth. In this lesson, we delve into the profound wisdom of simplicity. It's not merely about choosing a minimalistic lifestyle. It's a transformative mindset that can bring immense clarity and fulfillment to your life. Imagine simplicity as a gentle breeze that clears the clutter from your life's landscape, allowing you to see the beauty that truly matters. Simplicity, inspired by the teachings of Buddha, encourages you to embrace contentment as the ultimate form of wealth. It suggests that true abundance isn't found in the accumulation of material possessions, but in the peace and contentment that arise when you free yourself from the burden of excess. The journey towards simplicity involves two essential aspects, physical and mental decluttering. Physically, 
It means simplifying your surroundings by letting go of unnecessary possessions and distractions. It's about creating a harmonious living space where you can breathe, think, and move freely. Mentally, simplicity encourages you to declutter your thoughts. It's about letting go of worries about the past or anxieties about the future and being fully present in the here and now. By simplifying your mental space, you open up room for mindfulness, awareness, and a deep sense of inner peace. One of the remarkable benefits of embracing simplicity is the newfound ability to focus on what truly matters in life. It allows you to redirect your energy and attention towards your passions, relationships, and personal growth. With a simplified life, you can savor the present moment and find profound joy in the simplicity of existence itself. So as you embark on the path of simplicity, remember the timeless words of Buddha, contentment is the greatest wealth. These words remind us that the riches of inner peace and contentment far surpass the allure of material wealth. Embrace simplicity, and you'll discover a life enriched by the beauty of the present moment and the tranquility of a clutter-free mind. Mastering your mind is a journey of continuous learning and practice. These seven lessons, illuminated by the wisdom of Buddha, offer a roadmap to navigate the complexities of your inner world, leading to a life of peace, fulfillment, and wisdom. Thank you for joining us on this enlightening journey. Embrace these lessons as steps on your path to mastering your mind. Remember, the greatest adventure is the journey within. For more insights, subscribe and join our journey of discovery, peace, and clarity. Be with you.